you know, one of the reasons why our death toll has been so high compared to the rest of the world is that we're obese, man. Right? The I'm glad you went there. I'm glad dude. you went there. Dude, I mean, it's, you know, it is, comorbidities are the, are the main issues. Heart, heart disease and diabetes are, is, you know, are the main factors that are killing people here. So I, anything that gets people more active and, you know, exercising more and healthier is going to be good. So there are some people who never would have gone to the gym because they were worried about it, worried about how they're looking. And now all of a sudden they can work out through Zoom with people. You know, if you look at the data, dude, I mean, young athletes, kids, but I mean, they're, you know, n hardly any of them are having issues, right? And so they're not so much worried about themselves having complications from the thing. Sure. Um, they're, you know, they're more just worried about all the uncertainty. They're young. They don't know, you know, quite what to expect. We haven't, nobody in our, in, in this lifetime has seen anything like this, right? And so as an athlete, as, as a young person, but especially as an athlete, stability and, and um, you know, certainty is what we need and, and, and routine, right? And so when the routine is shaken up and the certainty is shaken up and then, then you start getting, um, you know, kids being a little bit more concerned and worried. And, and so I would say the mental part of, of this thing is really what's, what's affected them. The more that kids can see each other, you know, the more that they can do it in a safe way. I, I, you know, I think I have these conversations with parents all the time, man. I mean, I, God, we got to get these kids back in school. You know, social interaction is such a huge part of, of learning and, and growing. And, and so I think um, that piece has been, has been tough. Um, but um, it seems to me, at least with the athletes that we're dealing with, that they are still going about their routines. They're still working out. They're still doing what they need to do. They're getting with their coaches, some teammates, you know, in small groups and they're, and they're doing what they got to do. So, um, I think that, you know, it seems to me like they're, they're, they're holding it steady.